them, baby, don't you see? You're dealing with a small town country boy from Tennessee. Thunder? Yeah. Huh? Look, guys. We got one coming in. Not looking so good. And we were getting milk and bread and stuff from Walmart. Still have not found waters. The hurricane's quickly arriving faster than we want it to. Um, I guess it's, uh, no, not three weeks, three days. It's looking like it's going to be a Category 4. Um, now we have mandatory evacuation and lane reversal, and it's starting tomorrow at noon. Um, so we're not real sure what we are going to do. I know we need to get out of Dodge, being that we are stuck in a trailer. So I guess we will find out. Me and Kira and I are getting some last-minute colas out of the machine because, well, that's just what's important right now at this second. I know, right? Hey. What's wrong with the couch? <laughs> huh? That's your couch? I mean, I was just wondering. It looks nice and soft, I guess you could say. Lord Almighty. Walk down at school. Why? High school. Someone at the high school. So we had a lockdown today. And. Oh. My heart almost stopped. That is bright. Alright, well, so. Well, now it's dogs a dungeon in here. No, it ain't. Yes, it is. I'm opening some blinds. Well, open some blinds in. There you go. So, had a lockdown at school today. He said he got scared. Scared or scared? Scared? Yeah. He got scared. And. That's what you're supposed to say. Yeah, it is what you're supposed to say. Right All right. Now we're getting somewhere with a child. He said that's proper English right there. That's what I've been trying to say all along. But what do you mean people are freaking out? Yeah, so all the water in the town is gone, I guess. But we found some at the Harry Peter. AKA the Harris Teeter. And uh, we're only getting six of them, but there's people that uh, looks like they're stocking up for the rest of their lives on water. But uh, if they need to flush toilets, they can fill all their bathtubs up or whatever they have with water. So they'll have toilet flush water. So I'm not sure why they need 600 bottles, but hey, whatever. That's why the rest of us can't find any water. It's because people are hogging it. Kira? Girl, you driving? Hmm? Mm hmm? Get it, girl. Oh, is that they're going to Tennessee? That's funny. Well, we got some. Get it. Went and checked the mail at oh, America. Anyway, I don't think it's gonna weaken because um, it hasn't hit any land on the way here. Uh, I don't know. So we're like walking through people's yards because it's a shortcut. I'm sure they're like, what? What in the world? I guess we'll, since we have a mandatory evacuation starting tomorrow, I guess we'll possibly be leaving. Um, I'm not sure riding out a uh, Category 4 would be smart. I told her if it was just me and her, we'd probably ride it out. And uh, I told her I don't have anyone to, to stay here so I can stand outside with my American flag in my hand with a 100 mile an hour wind. I don't have anyone to film that. 160. Oh, 100 mile plus winds. 160. I don't think we're going to have 160 mile an hour winds and the neighborhood's going to be flat and leveled. But 
this neighborhood so far has withstood what Hurricane Matthew, Hurricane he, Hugo, Hurricane Irma, Irma, Irma. Irma. That's an awesome name. So I don't know. I guess we shall see. Well, guys, all jokes aside, it's getting serious now. Our our town is. I know it's hard to tell from the spot I'm at. I should have turned it on at Walmart. Our Walmart is closing at midnight tonight and will not reopen until Saturday or Sunday. I heard them get the call when I was standing at the money center. So you guys pray for the Carolinas, pray for our area, our home that we would like to come back to. And it looks like we will probably be heading to Tennessee tonight or in the morning, uh, but we will be leaving. So you guys cross your fingers. Don't hear how country it. Cross your fingers. That sounded pretty country, and I didn't even mean for it to come out like that. <laughs> Nature at its finest. Anyway, we got... Oh, you can't see it. We got storms that are... They've been lingering over us all day. And, uh, I don't know, but I'm ready to get out of here. And by the way, all y'all out there living on two or three sodas a day, the hurricane comes, all of a sudden you turn into a fish, and you need 40 cases. And yeah, I saw that on Facebook. Well, let me check the clock. It's outro time. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, tell them what's coming. Dun, dun, dun. Hurricane! Huh? Hurricane. Are we going to leave? Yes! We got to get out of here, don't we? Yes, 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 yes! Because we don't want nothing to do with it. So, my wife was in there getting ready. Yeah. Packing up. You packing up, babe? Daddy. Look here. Hey, it's hurricane packing that. time. My hurricane packing that. time. Oh, yeah. Yep. And the storm that's been brewing all day is finally here. So I need to get off here because the longer this is, the longer it's going to take to upload. And we may leave tonight. I don't know. I know. It's almost dark because of this ridiculous sized storm that's. Guys, it's not nighttime. That is all storm. Every bit of it. Because you can see there, it's still light. Not so much on this side. So, wish us luck. Cross your fingers. Guys, I may put my PayPal in the description. If you guys want to support the channel, support us during a time of not working, even $1 would be great. Um, Hey, I don't expect even a dollar in there. If you guys want to support the channel, that's up to you. I just saw, and I missed it. I just saw the biggest bolt of lightning I think I've ever seen in my life. And I missed it. Usually I would be out here with a camera so I can try to get some decent shots. So I'm going to get off here in case there is some more decent shots. Um, if you guys don't hear from me until we get to Tennessee... This is why, guys, because I'm sure, as everyone knows, it is coming. So, guys, love all of you. Thank you so much for the support. I've got to batten down the hatches. All the umbrellas, chairs, everything's put up. We're getting everything locked up. Uh, old, old Glory, she's down. She's come inside. We've got to finish putting the plants inside. The grill, gone. Chairs and umbrellas, gone. It's getting serious so hey y'all send a prayer out for old country and the family and uh mostly for our travels that we'll be doing and for tina d next door and pops because they probably will not be leaving my neighbor miss murphy say a prayer for all of us we'll need it um and until we see you again country carter signing out
Tennessee For miles and miles and nothing well, That's just home to me We got some friends and family gathered round Talking about them good times And Uncle Joel warned you about walking down the wrong line I ain't never been scared and I ain't really one for messing around you can bet your bottom dollar I'm about to throw down Have you ever seen the moon and the stars from the back of a Chevrolet With some George Jones on and the phone on roaming the bills are paid And your mind thinking my whole my thank God for the way she's made At the bonfire with your hands up just dancing the night away if it ain't never felt right like it did tonight, then baby, don't you see? You're dealing with a small town country boy from Tennessee. It's an honest day's pay, it's a back road, it's real long. Mud ties rolling down through the hollers, you can hear him as he's coming home. It was your first date down at the lake with a fishing pole in your hand? Was your first impression that his mama raised up a good man? Does he listen to your daddy talk about being lost and now he's found? With some scanner playing as they pass and one around. Have you ever seen the moon and the stars from the back of a Chevrolet? With some George Jones on and a phone on Rome and the bills are paid. I'm thinking my whole oh my thank God for the way she's made At the bonfire with your hands up just dancing the night away If it ain't never felt right like it did tonight then baby don't you see You're dealing with a small town country boy from Tennessee He was ten years old with a shotgun on his side Roaming like a free bird across the county line Granddaddy said, boy, if you find your dicks in land of light Oh, you better treat that girl right So if it sweeps you off your feet in your camouflage gown You can bet your diamond ring that he gon' put a knee down have you ever seen the moon and the stars from the back of a Chevrolet? With some George Jones on and a phone on Rome and the bills are paid. If it ain't never felt right like it did tonight, then baby, don't you see? You're dealing with a small town country boy from Tennessee.